hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel guys i sincerely want to appreciate every one of you who checked up on me while i was away on this channel thank you so much some of you called me some text even some came to my email i'm really grateful thank you so today i just want to quickly do a response to one of um, you you asked me a question how is is determined a confirmatory test no it's not a confirmatory test but we can confirm using unigold this is the unigold um test kit for hiv it's used for confirmatory then we, to do this test today we will be needing an alcohol swab pad that is it over there we also need capillary tubes so i will just take out one the one I need for this um, test, I'll just take out one and keep it aside. So, I'll also take out the alcohol swab part, the one I'll be needing for this project. I just need one for it, so I'll just keep it aside. So, this is what the um, test kit looks like when we open it. Here, yeah, this is what it looks like is hiv you can see the hiv days you can also notice that c and t and even that run part the c and t portion the t portion talks about the test line of which if the person is positive you see a line mark there and the control talks about if the person is negative you will see a line only at the control but if the person is positive you will see a line both at the control and the test line which is c and t so i just this that's the alcohol part i just um tore open i wipe my thumb thoroughly just to make it free from germs and dirt because i'll be going in with the lancet pin which will pierce through my skin and let out some blood so that is the lancet pin i will just turn it open like that it's open it has a very tiny mouth that mimics like that of a very tiny pin so you just do that gently if you're doing it for yourself but if you're in the hospital the healthcare providers will do it for you don't ask me if that was painful <laughs> do not ask me if that was painful at all so i will reach out for the capillary tube i apply pressure as i apply pressure by you know pressing my gum over my index finger you can see that the blood is flowing and i'm picking it with my capillary tube onto the sample portion of the test kit i don't know if you can see this clearly i just continue this process until i have enough i've taken enough blood that will be in okay for this you can see the quantity of the blood you need as i'm doing it here i just hope it's quite clear enough you know so i will just continue that process I'll continue doing that until i've gotten enough blood for the test like i said earlier this is a confirmatory test but nevertheless if you have a positive result in determine and you have a negative result here using this uni good then there's another level of tests you would need to do and that is done with the start pack so this is the buffer i'll be using i add one or two drops into it that sample line where i put my blood that point yeah that point so i'll just open it add one or two drops into it yeah like so now you can see i've added it and the reading has started taking place it's going to read all the way down to where you have the control that end yeah it will just read up to that point so if you get this test kit and you're confused about where to put your blood you can see this point that they said sample that is where to put your blood because i've had some persons and get the kit and they move on to putting the blood at this um, C and T region, which is the control and the test region. No. You put your blood at that round portion, which is the sample portion. So that's what you do. Right. So you can see now that the test is about, let me say, about a minute or two. 
we started doing the test you can see that line already showing at the control region this already shows that this result is negative nevertheless at the end of the video you will see what a positive result looks like so if it was a positive result you will see a line both at the control that's that part label c and as well as the part label t test so i would show you that just now so this is what um a positive test result look like on unigood looks like you can see that there is a line both at this control and the test region so thank you so much for watching please do well to like this video subscribe to join the family and click the notification bell so that you get notified each time i post new video